Right, uh, boys and girls, this is going to be the last video on the series of uh, <clears throat> the QRM Illuminator. Uh, I would like to thank once again um, to uh, Lee Neathway and Keith in Canningtown uh, for all their knowledge and um, uh, because without them I wouldn't be able to uh, <coughs> make this work. Right, uh, QRM Eliminators, cheap one, £60 or £20 the kit. Is it possible to connect to my radio? Yes. This one has RF Sense. Seller told me uh, to connect it to the Vox. I've tried. Uh, I'll show you. Give me a second. I'll show you uh, the jack that I bought for... Uh, uh, my Lincoln, it's a 2.5 uh, mono jack. Uh, <clears throat> I've plugged it into PTT control, so all, all the QRM uh, eliminators have PTT control. Maybe <clears throat> this is to uh, use on HF sets that push more than um, uh, 100 watts or 200 watts. I think the limit on this is uh, 100 uh, watts. So maybe the PTT control, honestly, I would ask some questions, but uh, I think this is made by uh, Radio M, uh, uh, Ukrainian uh, Radio M, so it's, uh, things get lost in translation. Uh, my cameraman is filming the model. Uh, what is this for, PTT control? It exists in uh, all QRM uh, eliminators, the cheap ones, uh, is to connect to HF sets, uh, not CB band uh, radios or PA, ignore the PA when they describe connect to PA, uh, don't ignore it because they're actually saying the truth. Um, PA on the descriptions uh, doesn't mean uh, power um, public address, it means Power amplification uh, circuit uh, is a, 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 a an abbreviation for uh, in uh, radio M terms for the last circuit on uh, on transmission. <coughs> uh, can I plug this uh, to any radio? Yes. Things that I found out uh, uh, testing it. Well, the impedance uh, seems to be different from uh, 50 ohms, uh, the internal uh, impedance uh, or resistance, impedance, resistance, yeah. Uh, no, I'm not sure how to say it, because uh, plugged to my antenna when I transmit with the radio, if I plug a SWR meter, uh, if I was, uh, let's just say, 1 to 1 on one channel, I become 1.2. So mm, be aware of that. Not sure about the others. Uh, I can try later on and post an update video because um, a friendly station has one. Uh, and um, I, can, I, can ask, uh, I can try to borrow it. As you can see, there's nothing... Uh, Plug that back. No antennas. No, um, no uh, PLs. No antennas. Uh, nothing connected. Only power and PTT control cable, which I've got the jack in my hand. Uh, can you plug a, a QRM uh, kit uh, to my radio? Yes. If it doesn't have a socket uh, for for. Um, uh, PTT control that the HF sets have uh, you will have to uh, have a bit of knowledge in electronics and dealing with voltages and vo uh, volt uh, voltimeters to find um, uh, voltages uh, to drive a relay okay and to drive a relay I mean uh, it uh, Testing this, I found out there is only an open circuit, and I'll show you in a minute. If you want to buy the kit and have uh, the kit for twenty pounds, come that comes from Ukraine or Russia, Poland, whatever you find it, uh, with the name uh, QRM a Noise uh, Illuminator X Phase. Uh, they sell the kits for twenty pounds. Uh, to 
to connect it to your radio if it doesn't have um, uh, a, uh, a socket to plug it into um, amplifiers uh, to get the values of TX and TX ground uh, you can do two things if you don't want to open up the radio okay you can drill uh, the the box uh, the X phase metal box if you buy uh, the metal one the metal one that shows up on eBay doesn't have RF sense this one does and I'll show you right now give me a second uh, I'm gonna get uh, the five uh, two five nine from my radio and I'm gonna show you that uh, this model sh uh, goes on uh, transmission mode or uh, loop mode or I think they call it on the thing bypass so it's a kind of a, a relay to uh, pass the signal from the radio when uh, transmitting onto the main antenna without passing through the <clears throat> through the electronic components okay uh, uh, I'm gonna ask my cameraman to film these two lights yeah I'm gonna like uh, cameraman can you show uh, uh, the back there's no PTT control connected I'll remove it okay so there's only power and PL for the radio I'm gonna <clears throat> uh, give PTT signal or transmission signal from my radio on only one watt lower the so you can film the the lights and that's it relay is working as uh, sensing proper uh, pr uh, um, it does it does sense uh, the, uh, the radio is transmitting so it can be used I'm powering one watt uh, not to damage uh, the finals on my radio but you can even use uh, uh, an handheld uh, of one watt to uh, to uh, um, to make uh, the relays work on this one. Okay, uh, I'm driving it with one watt and it works. Um, uh, right, opinions about the um, opinions about the P uh, PTT control. This cable that comes, well, it didn't brought the jack. Uh, the jack was soldered by me. It's a 2.5 uh, millimeter jack mono. Uh, you can find it on eBay to uh, plug to the jacks and Vox. But uh, don't bother yourselves because it doesn't actually work. Seller told me to plug the Vox, but uh, uh, he, he speaks Russian. I used a, a translator, and uh, like I said in the previous video, uh, something got lost in translation <coughs> what i think this is i think is a circuit uh, an open circuit uh, uh, okay I'll, I'll show you what it means and this might work to plug all the x phases onto your radius and uh, in a minute i'll i'll uh, give you examples okay, i'm gonna plug the ptt control to the back since I've got the jack, I cannot touch the two wires. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna short out um, uh, the jack. I'm gonna make a short uh, on on the on the jack with a multimeter uh, on uh, amperage reading. So it's a, I'm gonna provoke a short circuit between the two pins. Okay, so uh, it will give continuity or close the circuit on the two pins. Uh, cameraman, can you film the lights and uh, what I'm doing? Yeah, have a look and transmission line on or bypass on off on off so <clears throat> in this case it's an open circuit that you need to close it so uh, you can activate the relays uh, pay attention I can even disconnect the radio so <clears throat> you can see it's not being uh, driven by RF okay let's try again uh, 
cameraman try to catch the lights okay short short circuit again on off on off okay uh, this means that uh, is bypassed uh, relay uh, makes connection uh, straight uh, from the radio to the antenna no uh, no listening or tuning uh, abilities like the linears you know they pass from our uh, from uh, uh, reception to transmission and off again um, I'm gonna give you a few ideas now uh, if you want to buy the kit uh, spend 20 pounds uh, the cheap kit uh, that brings electronic parts and uh, components. It doesn't bring boxes or buttons or whatever that you'll have to search on eBay to, to get it. Uh, well, if you got a bit of uh, knowledge to work with a multimeter, you can always uh, find values to power a relay inside your radio <clears throat> uh, to uh, open and close a circuit uh, from the from the uh, finals uh, the final circuit. Uh, of your radio uh, a simple way to do it also is buy yourself a foot, pa a foot switch and whenever you're transmitting uh, if you press the foot switch it will make connection between uh, <clears throat> these two um, two, uh, two, uh, two cables okay and the P uh, PA uh, the PTT control will make uh, a closed circuit uh, you can also uh, buy the metal box if you don't want to have too much trouble. Uh, <clears throat> um, uh, modifying your radio, opening your radio if you're afraid to do it, which is my advice if you don't understand or don't know, uh, don't have a bit of knowledge. Uh, the metal box, one sixty pounds that you can see on eBay, doesn't have uh, PTT sense or. Um, uh, RF sense like the linears so I'm gonna give you <coughs> uh, some advice uh, how to change from transmission to um, to reception or from reception to transmission mode uh, drill a tiny hole on the metal box uh, connect uh, the PTT cables onto it with a switch that closes circuit when you press and open circuit uh, when you're listening okay so every time you transmit or you're gonna press the PTT go there press the button it actually it puts <clears throat> uh, the X phase onto this one doesn't need but if you're using uh, uh, one of them uh, on build kits or uh, the already built kit uh, with the metal box uh, doesn't have RF sense so it's a good um, a good um, a good idea uh, to modify one of them if you're gonna go for the kits on the box you can put a switch to close uh, the circuit uh, uh, that is um, uh, the PTT control okay I think it's only a signal uh, for uh, for what, I, what I've tested and investigated so it shouldn't be a problem to and like you've seen I didn't burn it okay uh, it shouldn't be a problem to uh, make a, uh, a closed circuit between these uh, these two um, uh, these two cables uh, these two um, yeah these two cables <clears throat> like I said uh, that's my opinion this is the machine to buy if you don't want to have uh, too much trouble with RF sense, PTT control and whatever, it works. Go through the videos on my channel. I'll try to make a series on it and this is probably the final video to close it with advice and ways to make it work. Uh, how, how did I make it work? Well, it was a struggle in the beginning. Uh, if I didn't add help from uh, two stations uh, that I know, uh, I would be in trouble. <coughs> uh, if uh, you enjoy <clears throat> doing a bit of electronic work, if you know how to, uh, if you enjoy that hobby, uh, spend 20 pounds, yeah. The uh, QRM Illuminator is worth uh, every single penny. Thank you, and uh, I'll catch you guys later. By the way, I've got other projects. 
so go through the videos uh, on the channel don't need to subscribe but um, uh, go and check it out what is being done